Harper and George going from one. Warwood and Orton from gate two. 19, Scott Ato, Dylan Carney from gate three. And from the outside, Gary Stalker and Stefan Burrow, gate number four. Right, hopefully we can get this round. We've got uh, full field for here, Warwick. So uh, round two, or group two, round one for them. Bit of gardening going on up there for uh, number 98. Clint Warwood and Paul Orton. Paul doing a bit of gardening there, getting it sorted. One of the problems they have is where they start off, they can fall into the rut, pushes them into the tape. So get them close to those tapes as it is. Yep. So you just about need to fill those holes in so you don't just push yourself into those There's run, ruts. They run forward. Right. Off they go. That Gary Stalker, Stephen Burrow had a bad start. They've stored on the line, but the battle's out the front. There goes Harper through on Ato. Harper and George it is. Jason Harper and Mark George just shot through on the 19 of Scott Ato and Dylan Carney to take the first place. 98, Clint Warwood, Paul Orton following in that third position as uh, the 67, Gary Stalker and Stephen Burrow get themselves into some safety. Well, every point is important because uh, you've got to get right through and you go straight into your semi-final. Yes, the top point scorers from three rides uh, go straight through to the semi-finals. First three from each heat, so it's very important that they uh, pick up as many as they can. But 16, Jason Harper, Mark George, just uh, doing it very, very well at the moment. They're pulling away from the 19 bike of Scott Ato and Dylan Carney. Clint Warwood and Paul Orton on the 98 machine, just uh, holding that third position fairly evenly spread now. Home they come. Three points to bike 16, Harper and George. 19, Scott Ato, Dylan Carney pick up two. And one point 